It does feel like everything's getting a bit more expensive. Well, that's because it is. The start of April is the new financial year, meaning a raft of bills will increase. So let's take a look at what's coming up. Most local authorities in England are increasing council tax by the maximum allowed. That's typically a 5% rise. It means an increase of £106 a year for the average household. It's a similar picture in Wales, where taxes are rising by between 5 and 11%. But in Scotland, council tax has been frozen until next year. Water bills are also going up by 6% or an average of £27 a year in England and Wales. Water companies insist the extra money will be used to reduce the amount of sewage dumped in seas and rivers, but campaigners say that money should come out of their own profits. You may well also be hit by an 8% rise to your broadband and mobile contracts, which will cost the average person around £50 extra on average. On both of those, you could save money by switching, so it is worth checking if your contract has come to an end. You may see other price rises too. The TV licence, road tax and the price of stamps are all going up. There is one area where things are starting to ease. The energy price cap has fallen to its lowest level in two years from April. It's been reduced by 12.3% meaning a typical saving of £238 a year for an average household. It is one sign of the cost of living crisis starting to ease, but with so many other bills going up, many will be feeling the squeeze for a long time to come.